Charlie George. Kelly. George again. A good ball here to Armstrong. Radford calling for one, and Radford go for this one, and Graham as well. Down goes Trappaneers once more. Leaving it for Nordahl. And now Van Hipst. Mulder. And Nordahl. A nice little chip by Nordahl, and McClintock equal to it. Mulder to head it back. Oh, and a good turn. Shot on the turn there by Van Hipst. For it. Radford in the six-yard area. And Armstrong with the kick. McClintock to Kelly. Made a little space for himself there, Kelly. And a bit more there as well. Radford in a little bit of space there. Belton ears had uh, straight away from him. Gives Radford a chance to turn it in, but Keel under there first. Kelly. To Graham. Played back a little deeper there towards Radford. And now Story. Played it back again. And in goes Charlie George. And the whistle must have gone. the corner was given so it couldn't have gone and certainly Charlie George was very close indeed to making it number two for Arsenal there here's the corner McClintock looking to get ahead to it and Martins to get it away Kelly to Armstrong again a good deep one in goes Radford for it and McClintock is right there Charlie George getting up to it Nordahl and Mulder still Mulder the most dangerous man they've got to watch Nordahl stepping over with De Vrind a great chance for Anderlecht here straight at Wilson Nordahl losing it to Graham and trying might and main to get it back George Graham to Bob McNabb right up can he turn it back a good cross there from McNabb with the corner. Radford getting ahead to it, stopped on the line by Trappaneers and kicked away by Highlands. But they've still got a hold out. And McClintock chased by Van Hemst and Wilson gathering that ball on the slippery surface. Taking his time. Nothing more than a few seconds left now. And it's all over! Bears Cup has been won by Arsenal. Three years running by an English club. First Leeds, then Newcastle, 